Hi guys, Emilia here. In this video, I'm going to show you how to make a bubble stitch in a contrasting color. And this bubble stitch will be made on the wrong side of the sweater or of the work, but it's also possible to do on the right side. So I've made my stitches up until where I want my contrasting bubble. So I begin by taking my contrasting color and I put it under the main color like this, hold it with my thumb and then I begin to make my bubble stitch in the contrasting color, the yarn over, insert the hook in the next stitch, yarn over, pull up a loop, yarn over, pull through two of the loops on the hook, and repeat for four more times. We now have five loops on the hook in the contrasting color and one in the main color. A total of six loops on the hook. So I take my contrasting color, put it to the side, hold it tight, take my main color, cross it over, and then pull through all six loops with the main color. And then I continue my round with the main color. And I can pull this a bit tight. When I do like this, I'll carry the yarn on the inside like this to the next bubble. But it's also possible to carry the yarn, the contrasting color inside of the work. You then, when you pull through all six loops on the hook, you take your contrasting color, place it here in the middle. Take your main color and then go around the contrasting color when you're inserting the hook in the next stitch. And then Continue to make, always making sure to go around contrasting color, which is then hidden here on the inside. This is also a good way to carry the color with you in your work, but it shows like this also on the right side then on this sweater. I Carry it like this on the back because that doesn't show on the right side. And then a third option is always to cut the yarn here and reattach it for every single bubble. 